Wave Studioverse is an ever-growing online community for plugin chains, where you can find thousands of chains for every kind of track. Studioverse chains are created by top engineers like Chris Lord Algae, Young Guru, Manny Maraquin, and hundreds more. But what makes it a real open community is that anyone can create chains and share them. You too can share chains for everyone to enjoy. Creating your own personal mix chains and sharing them with the Studioverse community couldn't be simpler. This all happens within the Studio Rack plugin chainer. To share a chain publicly, you first need to create a Studioverse profile and log in, which you can set up in a few easy steps from clicking the profile icon here. When you create a profile, you can choose your name and handle, upload a profile image, and even upload your bio with web links to give the community members a chance to get to know you and what you're about. The first step to making your own custom mix chain is to insert plugins in any order you like here. Changing the order of plugins is simple drag and drop, and right clicking gives you further options to bypass, copy, paste, disable, and remove plugins. Inside each plugin, you'll find its business as usual. However, if you want to get extra control that also simplifies how you and others interact with your chains, use the eight fully customizable macros, which you can assign by either selecting the plugin control from a macro or selecting assign the macro you want, then clicking the control in the plugin you wish to map, or by right-clicking any control in a Waves plugin and selecting the macro you wish to assign. Besides manipulating plugins, macros can also be set to control all the features within Studio Rack itself, which I'll show you later. Let's get back to the main plugin chain. As well as inserting plugins as you normally would, you can also create powerful chains within chains using parallel split racks and multiband racks. Multiband racks let you insert plugins in specific areas across the frequency spectrum, allowing you to build super targeted processing tools. If you're familiar with multiband compression, then the same concept applies here, though this approach is way more powerful as you can make any plugin multiband or any combination or arrangement of plugins multiband. Parallel splits work differently, giving you the ability to blend affected wet sounds together, such as reverbs, delays, choruses, distortions. Really, the creative possibilities here are quite literally endless. Now, in both multiband and parallel racks in Studio Rack, you can also assign the mini faders, pan controls, and width controls to any macro. And any macro can also link up with multiple controls, which you can view, edit further within the edit window from the main macro section. Now that I have a chain ready, let's share it with the Studioverse community. To share your chain, save it as a preset. Next, here is where you will name your preset. So give it a unique thumbnail image to help it really stand out with keywords, a text description, and an audio ID, which is important to do. Simply hit scan, put your session into playback, and let Studioverse listen to the track type that your chain is best suited for. And finally, by selecting visibility, you make your chain become public for the community and the chains that you share publicly will be available from your profile. If you prefer to keep your chains private, you can of course do so by not selecting this. Though we do encourage you to share your chains, as you never know, your chains may end up really helping other producers get the results they need much quicker in their mixes. What's more, sharing your chains directly with friends is super simple. Click the three dot symbol, then share, and you can either copy a web link, which you can email, or post directly to social media. If you use the link option, Users can explore information about your chain in the web version of Studioverse. And to load presets from a link couldn't be simpler. Just drag the link from your browser straight onto Studio Rack in your session, or copy the link and paste it into the Studioverse search bar. Now you know how to create and share your own custom chains in Studioverse, the rest is up to you, your imagination, creativity, musical instincts, and vision. Welcome to Studioverse. We cannot wait to hear what chains you come up with.